Now we will start with set theory. So what is set theory? Suppose we are having a equals to in curly brackets we have a e i o u so we can say that a is the set of values or set of vowels in English language so we are having five elements each of them is separated with a comma and they are enclosed within curly brackets so just to say it again a is the set of the vowels which are there in English language. Let's say we are having another set B which contains values 2, 4, 6. So we can say that B is the set of even numbers which starts from 2 and ends at 6. So two, since 2, 4, 6 are the even numbers so b is the set of these even numbers we can also draw a circle which will represent this so we will have let's say this denotes a so we are having a e i o u and then we are having another circle which is 2 which contains 2, 4, 6 elements now if we want to find union of it union of two sets so the symbol of union is is in the shape of U and what do we, what do we mean by union so union is union of any set will contain each and every element of the sets which we are considering so union of A and B will contain each and every element of both set A and set B so we will have A E I O U then 2, 4, 6 so all of the elements which are there in set A and set B will be there in A union B so we just learnt about union which is denoted by U like symbol which will contain each and every element of the cells involved now there is another type which is intersection which is denoted by this element this symbol you can say mirror image of U so what do you mean by intersection so we in intersection try to find the common elements between two or more sets so basically if this is set A and this is set B and if some values are common between them then this place will be known as this intersection so all these elements will be included in intersection but since we cannot see any common element between set A and set B so A intersection B in this case would be null but had it been a case uh, if we would have set let's say 2, 4, 6 and second set will have let's say 4 and 6 so in this case our A intersection will become 4 and 6 if we are talking about Venn diagram we can see this is A and this is B and this is this area is intersection so we will have 2 over here 
and then 4 and 6 over here so since 4 and 6 are common among A and B it is the intersection so A intersection B will have 4 and 6 as its values thank you for watching the tutorial please don't forget to click on the subscribe button for receiving more updates from being skilled